Good afternoon everyone and welcome back to Inglorious Fishing. Today we're going out on the boat, it's a Sunday, it is flat calm, there's one to two mile an hour winds and we're going to go out there, a little bit of bream and scad fishing and we're also going to do some lobster and crab fishing. So we've arrived at the bream grounds over the sewer pipe and what we're going to do is just drop these down we're going to try and hit into a few bait first bait fish that being scad mackerel bream that sort of thing just because i need some bait for my pots because i've got absolutely nothing so i'd like to get a few bait fish just for the pots nice big boats just come past there it's got a nice big wake got to hold on here and hopefully there's a few fish so i came out here yesterday and we had plenty of fish yesterday so I'm hoping that they're going to still be here today, but no day is the same as you all know, so we'll give it a go. Hopefully we'll hook into some bream or some scad, as I said, and we're bringing some nice fishing content. There's a few markings on the sound there, so I would expect a few bites. There's definitely markings on the sound there. First couple of bites there. Missed him. Now we got it. Yeah, fish off. Feels like it's going to be a black bream. They give a beautiful account of themselves. I love catching these black bream. I think that was just JP Ballet that just went in the background. Fantastic. This definitely feels like a black bream or a cooches, something along those lines. Nice vicious head bangs. Looks like a nice, nice black bream, that one. That's a beauty. That's a lovely, lovely sized black bream. Beautiful colorings and markations on it. Lovely stripe pattern there. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Well, looks like that there here. Gonna get it straight back down as I can see the sounder is full of fish. It is full of fish. Let's get this straight back into him, and get some more up. Get yeah, fish off. Yes. Feels like another bream. Look at the bend in the rod. Fantastic, this is. This is fantastic. Beautiful. You can't beat this. Straight into some fish. Oh, he's still on. I thought he had came off. Just slap line me. Not another. Bad little bream that, you beauty. Straight into the basket. Right, let's get some more bait on and go up for another drift. So I just thought I'd give you a run through of how we're actually catching these bream and these scad. What I do is I just use a spin rod and then all I've got is a set of feathers. Now these are a set of feathers made by Watson Lures. So a big shout out to Watson Lures for making these and sending these over. They are absolutely fantastic and they're really good for bream as well because the hooks are quite small. So all we do is have these set of four hooked feathers and then all we do is just put cuttlefish, squid, scallop frills, mackerel, anything like that. Just tip the hooks with a bit of meat and then send them down and the bream and scad absolutely love them. Also, you get cooches, bass, you can get anything on this. So, uh, yeah, Tim's had a dogfish on the feathers, so just shows you can get anything. Let's get back up for another drift, get these down and hook into some more of these fine fish. And we're fish on again. Beautiful. Another, another black bream. Well, everyone, we're fish on again. Yep. It's not a massive fish, but we're on again. Pulling up thick and fast. They love this cuttlefish. The set, the markings on the sounder is unreal at the moment. Let's fish all the way up the water column. It's just a black bream. Beauty. Not one to join the pot. Beautifully lit hook. We've got Tim next to us. Tim's drifting along with us on these fish. 
and we're slaying them. Let's get some more. Oh, fish on, this is going to end badly. It is. This is close. <laughs> this is close quarters is... fishing. You all right? Hey, hang on. I'll push you away, don't worry. Oh, we're right on top of each other. There's no more ocean. Oh, I haven't even got anything. Tim's got two black bream there, fantastic. Beautiful. Right, let's get these back down. Everyone would fish on again. We're absolutely slaying these fish today. Not a beautiful, beautiful black breed. Fantastic. They're coming up thick and fast, everyone. We're gonna get some pot bait fairly quick. Now, we probably ain't gonna go and do the wrecking simply because the tide's so strong at the moment. It's not, it's gone a little bit rough and a little bit choppy, not very nice for the trip. So we may do that later on in the day, but for now, we're gonna carry on with this bait fishing session. It's the fast ferry coming in all the way from Paul. Look at that ship go. You wouldn't want to be in the way of that. They haven't got a very good track record, everyone. Look at that thing go. We better hold on. Look what's coming towards us. Bit close for comfort, that. Yeah, everyone, I've got a nice fish on here. Some weight for this one. Come on. Oh, look. We've got a scad and a bream. That's why, everyone. Nice scad, nice bream. Two in one hit. That's what we want, two in one hit. That way, get this pot bait quite quickly. Let's get them straight back down again. Let's go. Everyone, another fish off. Oh, yeah. Well, that's a nice black green. Another nice beauty to add to the table. Yes. Oh yeah, we're fish on again. Put a nice bend in the rod, this one. Oh yes. We're well off the mark as well. Possible coochies? I don't know. Coochies normally run a little bit harder still. It's just a lovely black green. What a lovely sized black bream. We're just popping them off left, right and centre at the moment. Fantastic. There's loads of markings underneath us. They're all on the seabed. There's just loads of bream around lately, which is great. Let's get some more. Yes, I love this sort of fishing. Well, everyone, fish hard. Just had a big scad as well. This feels like a bream. Size for that one. Lovely, lovely stamp of bream, as I said earlier. Beautiful, beautiful bream. You can't beat this, guys. Fish coming up thick and fast. Hope you're enjoying it. Let's get back down and get some more. Yes. That's the scat I had as well. Big giant scat. Oh, look at that. Fish on. Whoa, that's a better fish. What is this? That's a better fish. Oh, that's why we've got more and more. What we've got on here? Oh no, it's a nice black bream. Oh, it's because he was fell hooked. That's why it felt so good. Fell hooked in the head. Straight back down. Yep, fish on. 
I got him. Oh, he fell up again. Fantastic fun, I love it. There's a bell hook, it's a small tiny bream. Uh, all his guts are hanging out. He ain't gonna survive. There is loads of markings underneath us. The sounder is just full of fish at the bottom. You can't beat it. What a great day's fishing. The wind has picked up though and the tide has started to make the sea state go a little bit choppy. So I don't know whether we're gonna be doing the wrecking, but we certainly have fun doing this, that's for sure. I've got him on. Yeah, boy! Feel like a bad fish. It's not massive. Another, another nice. Black green, not as big as the others. Still a lovely fish, nevertheless. Fish on. This don't feel like a bream. Oh, now it does. What is this? Could be a scad, big scad. Oh, that's a bream. Got to be a bream. That's a lovely bream. Nice, beautiful, black bream. Fish on. Yeah, we got him that time. This is a bream of some sort. Oh yeah, this is gonna kick, look at that. Going well. Lovely, lovely stamp of bream. Real head lunges on this one. Oh yes. Oh, that's a beauty. That's the biggest of the day so far. What a fish that is. You beauty. Magnificent black bream. As I said, I love catching these fish. It's just, they're just such good fun on the light gear. They just go so well. He was only finely hooked on the side of the mouth. You beauty. Another bit of pot bait. That is a prime, prime lobster bait. Let's get some more. Okay, everyone, we're back up for another. Just getting the line down. We had a bite then everyone, we had a bite then. Definitely into the fish, I can see him on the sounder. Oh, I'm hitched, oh, I'm out. I was hitched on the pipe everyone. We're out of that now. Swing back down, see if we can get into him on the other side. Fish on I think. Yeah, we got a fish on. Now this could be a scad. I reckon this is a scad. I don't reckon this is a bream. I can tell by the way it's fighting. I reckon it's a scad. There's nothing. Well everyone, I've decided we're gonna go do the lobster pots later. So this is gonna be the end of this video. We're gonna start making our way in now. We've had lots and lots of black bream. Tim's had some black bream and some dogfish also. So he's given us those as well for pot bait. So a big shout out to Tim. But we're gonna start making our way in now. Let's go. Well everyone, we're back into port now. Thanks for coming along on this sea fishing adventure. I don't know why I've got my jumper on. It is absolutely roasting, so we're about to take that off. Lots of bream, few scad, and Tim had that one dogfish. So all in all, not a bad little session, and we've got some lobster bait for the next trip, so you can't beat that. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll catch you on the next one. See you next time.